this is the StarCraft 2 Warlord here, and I am back with some more amazing StarCraft 2 action. Um, I just want to thank my subscribers, if it had anything to do with you guys. But, there's been a huge spike in my, um, amount of videos people have been watching. I hope it continues. Thank you guys, please continue what you've been doing. Keep on telling people about my channel, I love to have those subscribers keep on coming in please keep on liking and commenting all that good stuff anyway I love you guys um, and uh, all that stuff you're amazing but anyway let's get this game underway anyway spawning up in the top right corner we have Mao's mana talk about him a little later and spawning down in the bottom left corner we have K3 Lucifron, what up? Yeah. All right, now Mouse Mana. Interesting little fact here. Mouse Mana is the second most successful player in all of StarCraft II ever. I don't think he played Brood War. I cannot be sure about that. Um, and I don't know if he did, which I don't think he did. I don't know if he was successful. But I do know that he is the second most successful player in all of StarCraft 2. He is freaking amazing. And I am super excited. Because I think... I think I would be okay with him winning this one. Even though he's not K3. He's, he, he's the most... He's the second most successful player. Of course, um, Stefano is the first by a fairly large... Um... By a fairly large margin, if you guys don't know who Stefano is, then there's something wrong with you, I'm just gonna be honest. But, um, anyway, yeah, so that's the scoop. Um, and, so he's, he's that, he's pretty freaking amazing, I watched some games of his, they're amazing. Um, and he's Protoss, which makes it even better. Who do you have the probe attacking this barracks here? I don't, I don't know if that was, um, unintentional, or whatever, but, um, Hang on a second, guys. I think I, um, got something to do. Graphics, lighting. Oh, that sucks. Um, lighting allows greater realism in all lighting effects. Hmm. God, it would be really, really nice if I could set this to a higher graphic settings to a um, higher setting I don't know um, I don't know but uh, oh well you know whatever oh well I'll just turn up my shadows there's no low I right, let's turn up my shadows put them on what does this rely on graphics card I, I got a high graphics card I'll just put it on ultra. That worked. Let's make sure that worked. Uh, Shadows ultra. Yep. All right. Cool. All right. The reason I'm doing this is because it just um didn't seem quite seem kind of dark and you know little little phasey so or not phasey but um. Hazy, yeah, that, that's the word I was looking for. But anyway, yeah, this game is gonna be underway pretty soon. We do already have the second command center going down. Warp gate research on the way. Got one barracks out. I love one racks expands. I used to be so scared to do them, but I realized versus Protoss, you can basically, in most cases, you can safely, um, as a Terran, in most cases. You can safely forge fast expand versus Protoss, but that's uh, this is no time to talk about it. Oh, the Stalker is out. Stalkers, they are not nearly as fast as Reapers are 3.75 uh, movement speed, and Stalkers are 2.95. Um, so they're not actually nearly as fast, but but they can certainly they're certainly fast enough to be able to chase down those reapers. I mean, they can't actually chase down the reapers, but they're fast enough to stay around with them and, um, and, you know, just, uh, fin them off. Um. 
Plus, Reapers have Reapers have a range, a range of five. Oh, actually, I think Stalkers have a range of five as well. Oh no, Stalkers have a range of six. I love this Mother Mothership Core placement. It's amazing because um, Mothership Core can drop a time warp on the Reaper, which I'm not sure how 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 far does it actually slow it? Um, warps everything. Blah blah blah. Movement speed reduced by 50%. That's actually pretty awesome. We do have a a probe sitting out here. I don't know if this is for a proxy or anything, but um, whatever it's for, it's freaking it's it's gonna it's gonna work, guys. I'm I'm calling it right now. What? Why can't I spot this? Oh, guys, Marines, you need to drop a time warp. Oh, it's not gonna be enough though. Oh yeah. But look how slowly they move when they're under time warp. That's freaking crazy. These Marines, they're they're sitting there. They're like, hey guys, um, is that um. Is that Mothership Gore dying like uh 50% slower than it would normally, guys? And but they're like, yeah, but it don't matter because we are still like 50 bajillion Marines. I mean, not literally, but uh, they are a lot more Marines than that Mothership can handle, even with the time warp. Because that that also not only does it mean that their movements be wait 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 a minute. Hang on, hang on, hang on, guys. Have their movement speed, movement speed only. I'm not sure if that is attack speed. Um, actually, I want to look that up right now. Hang on, hang on. Uh, I'm looking it up. Let's see. Don't worry, guys. Um, I'm I'm still watching. I know what's going on. Uh, wow, a third base is being taken already. Um, we got all these marines. I I gotta say, I'm tired of players just going for mass marines okay because mass marines are they're boring it's boring call it a boring alert um huh but um anyway yeah absolutely boring where's why i swear i th this is why i turned up the lighting effects because i cannot see anything on this map um there's the observer in this factory. The observer seeing everything. Look at this. Look at this. He sees. He sees everything. He sees that there's marauders being produced now. He sees that there's uh, medevacs being produced. He sees that um, we're probably gonna have something out of that factory. He just he sees everything. But we do have a very minor engagement there. I think that. Look at that. Look at that. The ah. Oh, god. I love the death animations. They're freaking good. Oh god. Oh yes. Oh, but my computer is getting hot. Ah, oh, I better stop charging it. Oh, uh, sorry guys. Spoiler alert. My computer is a laptop, but don't worry, it is the most high-end laptop that you can get. Okay. Well, actually, not really, but it's high enough to get these graphics. Which, I mean, you guys are okay with these. I hope you guys aren't that shallow that you're like, oh, oh, um, now, now that I know. I mean, I thought it was okay before, but now that I know it's a laptop, uh, uh, all of a sudden these graphics are terrible. Hope you guys aren't like that, because that's totally terrible, and I hate you. Um, I love... Uh, seems like people from... From Team Mouse just get a... Um, just get a lot of observers. Or from, from Mouse Sports. Seems like they just get a lot of observers. Where is... Ooh, Oracles! Oracles in the house better move cuz them marines gonna have you pretty soon. Oh, did he die? No, no, he's alive. Oh, is he gonna go for some of them SCVs? No, he's gonna come over here. Oh, he better hurry cuz that missile turret is almost done. Oh, it's done. Ah! Oh, the Oracle dies. Oh, God, no. Well, I was really hoping that thing was gonna live, but, um, yeah, the Terran is way ahead in army supply. I don't know what is up with mana right now. I don't know. For for somebody who is, in fact, the most successful player, or the second uh, most successful player in all of StarCraft II, his macro is slipping. It's it's slipping like, um... Slipping like whenever, uh... Like whenever you're uh, walking on tile barefoot because you can't... Uh, find any socks. 
or you're too lazy to get them. And then, um, oh, you have the Colossus, that's uh, really amazing. But uh, it, it's just, it's really slipping, okay? Really slipping. That's took, took a little too long for me to get there, so I'm just gonna say it's really slipping. That metaphor was, that metaphor was not meant to be. Are they seriously gonna drop there to, to, to get that probe? That was terrible. That was terrible, guys. Oh, man, why would he do that? That was bad. Okay, guys. Also, um, I am going to be uploading some ladder play, as I said before. Um. Also, um. All right, here's what I'm gonna do in my ladder play. I'm gonna call it the ladder action series. The Warlord ladder action series, rather. Um. And in it, um, I'll upload like one video, like two videos a week, two or three, depending on what schedule I'm on. Um, and then, well, we do have this uh, drop moving in, but I think you guys can see that. That's why I'm not sort of talking about it. Because it's zealous warping in, and take it, and the two colossus is gonna take it down. Oh, oh, I hate that. Oh, didn't even get the med back. What's that range? Long range attack. That is true. I think it's got a range of like 15 or something, which is freaking good. I mean, in StarCraft, oh gosh. It's like, it has a range of like what I thought Vikings had. Yeah. Um. We do have another army moving out. Gosh. This dude, Lucifron, isn't backing down. Really, I'm not really rooting for anybody. I mean, I am sort of staying on mouse. And you can usually tell who a caster is rooting for by, uh, who's, by whose view they're staying in. Don't let it die! Oh, God. If you let that die, I was going to be so ticked. I was going to be like, are you for real? Uh, the Vi Vikings kill Phoenix. Vikings kill Phoenix. I'm serious. One Viking versus one Phoenix, that is not even a fair fight. Oh, this is amazing by Lucifron. I'm, I'm starting to root for him. Uh, the Colossus moving down to take care of this since they got this drop in the main. Um, what was I looking up, guys? Oh, yeah, yeah. Does. Hang on, guys, hang on. Hang on. I'm gonna use Siri. Oops, hang on. Alright, here we go. Does time warp slow attack speed in StarCraft 2? Alright, here we go. I don't understand. Guys, time 4T in StarCraft 2. Oh, but I could search the web for it. Okay. Hang on, guys. This does not work, I swear. If you, if you guys are considering... Like, getting an iPhone or an iPad, and, like, the only reason you want one is because of Siri. Don't get it. It's freaking bad. I swear. Have you just heard what it said? That it, It's ridiculous. Does time warp slow attack speed in StarCraft 2? Alright, I think this is gonna be the one. Let me think about that. Oh, God. Oh, Would you like me to search the web for does Tinger slow attack speed in StarCraft 2? Whatever, guys. Just forget it, because that's not going to work, okay? Ooh, this could be it for, um... This could be it for mana. Ooh, I don't want that. Ooh, that would be a bad thing. Oh, I think this... I think this is going to be it. Oh, God. Oh, they got the Colossus. Oh. Oh, they're dropping me. Yeah. Oh, and Mana throwing out the GG. I gotta say, that is not at all what I expected. I mean, oh, God. Uh, K3 only getting one win, and then you're like, oh, God, K3 needs a win. And then they come up with Lucifron against Mana, and you're like, oh. Oh, man, it's not... Uh, it's not even worth considering, guys, because mana is freaking good. But I guess he wasn't good enough for this. I mean, as odd as that sounds, I don't know. I don't know, guys. I gotta say, I was really, really expecting mana to just take that one. I was. Um, but I guess he just didn't have the stuff to pull it out. Um, it was really probably the multitasking here. Those drops, 
Plus, I don't know what it was in the beginning. His macro was just slipping. I don't know. Whatever it was, whether it was a huge um, upgrade lead. Yeah, whether it was a huge upgrade lead or bad micro or macro or whatever. Um, uh, in this series, it is now Lucifron 2, Mana, uh, or um, Mouse Sports 3 as uh, wins. So they're really close. If they can pull out another win, it'll be tied. And then if they can pull out another win after that, it'll be... Um, It'll be, uh, what's it called? Um, uh, K3 will be in the lead, but I honestly don't think that's going to happen because I honestly, I think that Mouse Sports is a superior team. But anyway, enough about that. You guys heard what I said. Subscribers, like, comment, and tell other people about my channel. Non-subscribers, if you're watching it, also like and comment and tell other people about my channel. But you have another very important duty. Subscribe! That's right. It's uh, it's not complicated, guys. All you have to do is uh, go to YouTube and click the subscribe button. It's not complicated, guys. If you uh, want more instructions, go to my website, and I'll tell you how to go to YouTube and how to log into your account and how to click the subscribe button. But seriously, it's not complicated. Please do that, guys, and continue watching. Please, everybody. Uh, but anyway, yeah, so, uh, this was a great game played by both players, and I'll keep up with this Ace Team Story Cup. Uh, watch my channel, all that stuff. So, this has been the StarCraft 2 Warlord signing off, and I'll see you guys next time!